Okay, so here's the game plan. I'm uh, gonna pack up my raft, get in the backpack, and navigate my way up through this terrain, up and around this beast, and then further on, and hopefully meet up um, with the water again, so I don't have to walk back this way, but so I can put back in the water and paddle back. That'd be the ideal situation. Um, yeah, my original plan was to go back further and do something further back there, but uh, this is calling to me. I must, must listen to the call. I'm rocking these uh, bedrock sandals today because I wasn't planning on doing too much out of the water. This will be a good opportunity to see how they do off trail like this. Um, I've, I've used them quite a bit. A uh, couple trips to Alaska had them and um, a lot of stuff out here in the desert, but um, uh, yeah, see how, they, see how they hold up for this. Hopefully it is sufficient because I can't resist this little idea. That's the plan. my stuff in my pack. Pack grass in there, got the life jacket on the outside. Um, paddles fit in there pretty good, so I'm off for that way. But first I'm gonna jump in this lake while I still have it and cool down a bit. Whew, it is a hot one. I am uh, barely into this thing, and already I can tell I need to be careful with my uh, energy use. It's so hot out here, and this initial climb is um, so steep that it, uh, man, every t every step takes a ton of oxygen out. Not to deal with the work necessarily that my, you know, legs and stuff are doing, but to deal with this heat. Um, yeah, I've hardly gone anywhere. Um, so make sure I keep a good slow pace, keep the fluids going in, and then also these are the kind of things I gotta always check myself in. Make sure I'm not overdoing it, make sure I leave room to evac if needed and uh, get back down and still have energy to reinflate the raft and get myself home. Um, also gotta stay super vigilant out here for snakes. This is um, sketchy territory for that kind of thing. Um, and the more dehydrated you get, the stupider your brain gets. So I'll definitely be taking advantage of these kind of spots. Oh, they don't come very frequently because the sun is up pretty high, but I get a little bit of shadow here. The trick though is that there's other creatures that want the shadow too. Um, some of the snakes can be in here and stuff, especially this kind that has all these little nooks and crannies. So. Um, it's kind of a risky situation, but we both are trying to survive. Found another excellent shade spot. I approve. Yeah, it's hot. Pulling out all the tricks now. Got the weird shirt hat thing going on. It's all about survival. 
almost up to that ridge. And I'm gonna see what's what's what from there. Decided I prefer uh, loosely covered shirt hat over ninja style shirt hat. Okay, I just popped up over that first ridge. Um, this is what I got in front of me, and I'm trying to make the call now. I'm gonna cool down here in the shade, drink some water. That uh, that hill was brutal. The sun reflecting off the, the hillside like that, and um, yeah, it took a lot out of me. So I gotta try to figure out what's smart to bite off today. Um, this plan of coming up around this thing was originally a, an idea I thought would be a good winter adventure. Um, for obvious reasons, but uh, thought I'd at least scout it out. So getting it, being able to see this is cool in itself, even if I headed back down after this. But um, yeah, I'm gonna sit here for a while. I'm gonna pull out my map, kind of check over some things and see see what it looks like on the other side of this stuff. Um, but a lot of it's looking a little bit ambitious for for how I'm feeling today. But like I say, I'm gonna chill here in the shade for a little bit and, and then make the call. So I just got done looking over the map, both for today's adventure and also for future possibilities. <clears throat> um, in order to make my way around this and drop down the water like I was imagining, I'd have to run a lot of this canyon and then even that um it's a little uh it's going to take some route finding through there because there's going to be some sections that that i can't tell from the map alone um if, if they're doable or not um and with the, with it being this hot like it is um the clock is ticking against me kind of thing and so it, I either need a straight shot or or I need to do it for another day. So it might need to be a winter thing because it's going to be more exploratory and I'll probably run into a few hiccups along the way, which makes for a fun adventure. But um, when it's this hot, it just makes for dead. A little bit disappointing that I wasn't able to come up over this and get into the water, but I kind of knew that coming into this, that it was a... Um, that that was a possibility, so... Still kind of a good thing to be able to get eyes on this. I like this little canyon here and nobody's gonna be back here like ever because it's kind of stupid to go back here. But that's the kind of places that I like. So um, I'll probably be coming back here, especially in the winter um, and push on further into this country. Um, and definitely try to see if I can pop back out on the lake further on or just run these plateaus and ridges too, that'd be cool. So I'm gonna go back down to the water. I'll get back in my boat and all that and then I don't know, decide what I what I feel like doing. One thing I uh, like about having these sandals on out here is this uh this grass this time of year the the mesh if you have shoes that have mesh on it these little things stab in there and are super irritating but if you're just running sandals um you don't even feel anything so i know i say this a lot but these little shade spots are like lifesavers they're uh even when you're not like super overheating emergency style, like if you tuck into these regularly enough, it, it's uh, it's amazing what it does for you. The trick is to keep your keep your body from overheating. You don't want your core temperature getting so high that you're like seriously in need of these spots. If you can keep ducking it down by popping into these things, um, you can hang out a lot longer.
the lake is getting closer. Almost time to get the pack raft back out. Get in the water. That'll be nice. Just taking a little break in the shade again, though. It is a hot one. Um, <clears throat> oh, these uh, ah, these um, sandals, these bedrock sandals, they're uh, they're doing pretty good. They don't they got a little bit of tread on them, and that's uh, pretty sufficient for what I've been doing here. There's been a couple of times where coming down this, especially where the the rock's been real loose and it slid on me. But it wasn't really any different than if I had a different shoe on. It didn't even scrape my foot up in the process, so that's cool. 